listen to the music. The music is the best part, I think. What? So, I'm kind of half annoyed, but also very happy that I can finally, like, play this game. It was some, like, back and forth thing with, like, the game taking so long to deliver. And second of that, I lost my recording twice. 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 So, this is essentially Shadow of the Colossus. And Shadow of the Colossus is kind of this game with story and such. Not, I will just say this, as Donkey himself said in the Donk view, is that this is a game every game should experience at least once, even though the controls might be very sucky. So, to let you escape the, the struggle of playing with the controls, I'm gonna be playing with, uh, we're gonna uh, be playing for you. I know this might be play normal. Uh, I know a lot of people might not enjoy it, and you might not be a fan of story games, but really, Star Shadow of the Colossus is the game you should give a try. This is also my first time recording with the PlayStation 4, so um, if you've got any tips for me, tell me down below. Because I don't know, it's a very poor thing we made up here. Really. I forgot yeah. to tell actually Teflis right behind me. I am. He's kind of, he's the like awesome dude let me borrow his PlayStation 4 to play it again. And then I forced myself to be in the video with it. <laughs> he, you had to join. Once you actually borrow me the place for being so nice, I kind of had to push you in the video. Come on. Yeah. No way. You can borrow it without me. I can. I just feel like a dick if I ever do that. Like take someone else's game console because I'm too lazy and buying my own. You're all right, <laughs> Thank you, man. Okay, so. That's our boy. You can, you can. I think you can see on like it's not as good on the TV because this, this screen we're playing on right now it's 1080p. It's not the best one, but right this like, like, like all the details you can see in the rock. For example, the ref, the reflections of the sunlight and such, and like how you can actually see a little bit of like a dentist and such in the stone is a massive improvement over the PlayStation 2 and PlayStation 3 one, and all just in general. I kind of like the mist here, even though the mist can get annoying once you're climbing the colossi. Do you now see the corpse now? Yeah, I see the corpse now. You don't really pay attention to it the first time? No. It took you two times to watch the cutscene here, until you realized it was a corpse. Although, from one angle, it kind of looks like those bugs you find in New Donk Shin in Super Mario Odyssey. Those Right no, there. I, I mean the the, the, the oh. those bugs, those bugs. The new dog cheating. Yeah, we're gonna compare this entire game to Super Mario Odyssey now. Yes, we are. Because you you had this that one boss fight in Odyssey, which you fight a giant, and you're gonna compare it to this. Yep. Here we have personnel the Tef. So gonna he okay. Fun fact, my friend here, he compared Fallout 4 to Minecraft. You told me about the building. To be fair. <laughs> yeah, but you, I showed you the trailer and then you saw build and I was like, oh, Minecraft. Monsters, Minecraft. <laughs> we kind of we're kind of destroying the scene. We are. Maybe we should just mute ourselves. Probably. But now nah, we're dicks. <laughs> but like look at how his clothes look and such how you can see much more detail here. Yeah, and the cart is clipping through the rock. That's pretty beautiful. <laughs> Come on, can I, can't you appreciate like how much effort Blue Point put into this thing? It looks so good compared to that. Give you. And here we got a flashback with Madagascar coming up. Was you Edged into stone. Did they mean like the Colossus statues? Olik, Olazoram's friends. Cars. Ilzozeri Kua Zoko. Amnos Kludu. Laomism Wop. Was the UAD Ulaz also? It is said in this world, if one should wish it, one can bring back the souls of the dead. The dead. And we are exactly that one. Pretty convenient, isn't it? Well, shit. So I still don't know 
I have a question for if you know in the comments, tell me down below, but is do any of you know is that Japanese or any other Thai kind of language? Or is that just completely made up? I don't know. Because it sounds like some sort of language since they use the same like last like they use the same sounds and such in both in all the remakes and such, you know. They're not monkeys, you think, yes. Oh, you see here? Here's the difference, okay? This, you can just put a comparison, okay? We are the pro gamer. And we all here got the noobs. The Christmas noobs, okay? Then we got the sword of Reddit White... The Reddit White Knight sword. Strike down those foes for thinking they can simply walk into our community like this. With my since I, I paid five hundred dollars for EAs for this sword, be gone. <laughs> Since you that, this cutscene takes so long. I'm just it's it's I'm, I'm good. I I'm good. Remind myself from editing me. Put up like a time skip so you can just edit, skip this entire part if you're not interested in seeing the cutscene. Because like some people who have already played this already know the cutscene. I probably just want to see us playing up around. That is our whole holy lord. Our holy lord. So thou art mortal. Yes, fun fact, I am dead I can die. Let's try not to. Hmm? Let's try not to. I remember when we played this on hard and he literally squeezed me between his ankles. And that's the end of hard mode. Yeah, like hard mode. He can he kill you so much easier. I was one one leg, and he just kicked me on his with his other leg while I was climbing. We are we are the one known as Dormin. Are there two? We are the one. We are number one. <laughs> du, 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 du. <laughs> If the least do is the <laughs> I know this game is supposed to be very like the story, I'm probably destroying it. It's just I've been watching it. We've seen this cutting like four times now. Because Dorman, if you come here to the voice, he is he has two voices. He has like a female and a voice and a male one. And the reason is because he's not supposed to have a gender. It's gonna be like this overgodly thing with no connection to this reality, you could say. It would be really cool if you could fight Dormin though in this game. If they he became a Colossus. But that would be way too predictable, quite honestly. This game tried to be as unique as possible, and I think, uh, just saying this, like, compared to what today, like, you really, it needs to be more original stuff like this, because Cryptarium of Colossus was extremely original and very unique at the time, and it still kind of is, but it's been a lot more saturated since, like, like back then, and the animation of Child of the Colossus was so much better than any other game, but now that animation is standard, so you don't really pay attention to it. The PlayStation 2 had a lot of love put in, into it. We are supposed to kill the Colossus, as Dormin is explaining to us now. And all of these idols are supposed to represent one Colossus, and there are 16 in total. Just telling you, in case some people don't know. So we're gonna fight a snake and such, excuse me. Snake and all these others. Let's play snake. Snake! Snake! Snake. Just add that in. I understand. But heed this: the price you pay may be heavy indeed. But since our character is a pro is a teenage, we filled with hormones. He won't don't give a fuck. He doesn't understand the concept of consequences. <laughs> Just to tell you guys, this we've been recording for ten minutes already. Ten, ten minutes already, okay? And it's just cutscene. Well, there was that one intro part you did in between the two cutscenes. Yeah, but it's been cutscenes for like ten minutes now. I... 
So we're about to start now, and now we're actually going to be playing on a proper monitor, because back at your house, like a Teflite house, you could use a projector, and the projector was good enough, but this thing looks a lot better on the monitor. No, be on thy way. So since we already played this a lot of times, so I know exactly where to go. So essentially, if you're... The thing with placing with uh, Shadow Colossus back then, which was so original, is that it was an open world, and now that, that now that open world is just saturated like all hell. Like every game is open world by now. But the thing with this is that you just got open to this vast, vast landscape, and whew, just need to look at the graphics, and everything. That's a lot. That's so much better, than you Like how the actually grass sways in the wind. Uh, but you were you were all put into this open world, which was quite unique on time, and. Uh, and then you were just tasked with killing these and finding where to go and th they did that by doing this and that was very cool by the time to have like marker using as your store was like a marker and such I just had a little, little mini map and all this to like guide your way through the open world mm -hmm. and I think like definitely like, I think you can especially like see how a lot of these games features are now put into nowadays game uh -huh. right right see that well, most games nowadays still have the minimap, but... Yeah, but I mean, like, you, you, it's, it's, it's kind of like, it's to show that... Uh, it's, this was technically some of one of the first, you could say, proper, completely open... It's not a good open world, because the world is not that big, you know, it's not... It's not. It's it's relatively big, but it doesn't got a lot in it, like Legend of the Rift of Wild has. And such. Now, here's going to become one of my... Yeah, that thing was also very unique back in time, where like the horse will stop if you ride him into, you ride him into, um, like you say, if you ride your horse into the wall, he will stop. That was some people got very confused at that because before they would just like don't give a fuck, you know. But here is completely different. I'm just gonna comment this because I just want to point that really out because it is a huge difference from what it was before, quite honestly. There. Circle. Do you really roll? Dark Souls. Shove the closest. It's just like Dark Souls. Look at this. Hey, that's my job. <laughs> You're the one who's gonna compare this game to everything. Yep, indeed. The graphics. They are Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild. <laughs> that's probably more like a play uh, PlayStation 3, maybe. Yeah, you can you can see now on since on the projector we couldn't see on the rhythm the rock, but if you look on a rock here, yeah, you can see every single little detail. And I think that's because on the projector is is your projector 1080p even? I don't know. I think probably it's 720p, not. so you can't really see the. <gasps> you said that every recording. <laughs> I did, but it looks like a mammoth when it comes out of that wall. Just, yeah, I guess because you still only see the first legs, but that's not the mammoth of the game. You know where it is. <gasps> You spoiled a future, future enemy man. that is totally another Colossus and stuff like that. Hey, Colossus, I'm gonna just do this quick because I already know how to fight you. I've done this way many times and I've way more than I probably should have now. Way many times. Don't question my English. English. Huh? English. Now, Wondera is, just fun fact, if you've never known this, Wonder has this strongest grip in human history like this dude should just become a champion at like squeezing stuff with his bare fists what he did not go down from my head yeah but he he did play the cutscene though. he didn't play the cutscene probably, <laughs> probably because we played it so many times he just didn't bother we might, we may be grabbing his ass, but it's called no homo, so it's okay. Oh, all right, hold well, on. That changed with everything. Oh, but look at how the fur like moves. And how it actually looks like, kind of like hair. Oh, come on, this. Come on. You're about to. Cause I think he has nose rings. Yeah, he has nose rings. Did those just spawn? 
they did. That was very nice. Just, oh my god. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Gotta get the maximum potential. I'm sorry, man. I killed you so many times. I love this fight. But you need to go. Weird. The saddest part is like you see his eyes dark now. You see, it's like he dies completely. All the life vanishes put in him. And he's kind of like, you're the evil man here. Because these guys are just walking around. They're not doing anything wrong. You're just killing him because of a personal gain because you want to save someone. But if you do that, you're like making everything worse. Dark Souls roll. Those also look like Dark Souls enemies. They're, they look like Dark Souls. <laughs> That's a dry joke. Is there? Uh, talking about being dry, I need some water. So. <laughs> the light! Oh god, oh. He did. <laughs> it's gonna like if I don't. Because I'm recording my audio on my computer, but recording gameplay to the PlayStation 4. So I didn't touch my computer, so like it, it almost turned off. There's the monkey. <sighs> There's the monkey. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a monkey. That's Orbe. Is that a? I don't think she's her sister or anything. Because if she's our sister, a lot of people in this community who likes Shadow Colossus will probably be taken for incest. It's one down. Funnily enough, the fight against him took, I think it, the fight against the Shaktra Colossus took one tenth, no, one fifth of the time killing <laughs> from like, 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 compared to the cousin. Yes, right. Welcome to Shadow of the Shadow of the Cutscenes. Shadow of the Cutscenes. I think they. Just, I understand if they let it work a lot on cousins, because like they want to show, hey guys, we made you call this cool game with so good graphics, right? We made right. cool. Yes. The next foe is. It moves slowly. That's for sure. It's the next one is extremely slow. It goes all like wiggle wiggle wiggle. Should probably make the joke when I actually get to the area. Yeah, you're right. Forget I said it in the You know what's funny? You know what's funny part? Is that in the original game, you cannot look at her. The Look at this is Mo. I think her name is Mo. Because uh, our main character here, he's called Wonder. That's Agro. Or as Jacksepticall calls him, Eggroll. And this is Mo or Momo. I don't. I don't know if it's Momo or Mo. No. So that's a cow. But you can't in the original one. You cannot like move your camera more towards her at all. Like this, you cannot do this. And I think that was because like some people tried to look. They were, because if you did that, her rest of her head would stay put, but the rest of the body would disappear. And I think that was because they didn't want people to try to look up her. Anyhow, that joke was kind of weird, but it's time to just go right up on top of that horse ass and let's go, baby. It almost looked like the horse was trying to escape. Why would it? <laughs> I don't know. BSDLT. Great. If the found the altars, offer a prayer before it, and thy wounds shall be healed. Even though it, I think we heal automatically all the time, don't we? So uh, that's pretty useless, but I had really paid attention to the health. It's in the bottom right. Yeah, I've seen where it is, but I've never paid attention to it. Oh wow! Oh wow! I tried to grab. I forgot yes. that the game doesn't grab for you. Parkour. Yes. I can climb up big. I can climb up the biggest of enemies, like giant colossi, but I can't. I can't. Can't climb this. Can't climb this. See. Parkour. Parkour. Agro! 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 
the, the best part actually is when you get into a fight and you have to call your horse, the, the character actually begins screaming like pure, like he is in the fight. Like, ah, bro, get your ass over here. Wait, man. I'm just gonna come up on him like this every single time. It's the best. <laughs> the animation of him kicking is all stiff. So I think we're supposed to go behind here, right? Yeah. That's our next, like, uh, area to check. <laughs> I like, kinda, cause the, the camera, how the camera fixes itself, works, kinda, sometimes, like here, the camera fixes itself, and it just looks absolutely amazing. But, on all other, um, uh, but on when you're fighting Colossal, you're trying to look at areas, the camera just wants to auto adjust sometimes and it and it, it it's cinematic but and look good looking but it destroys all like practical use which is kind of complaining for me for the game dark souls it's hard it's not dark souls you got them why did i make the joke i think this video is going to be around how long 20 not 29 30 minutes I think I will try to aim for every video to be around 15 to 30 minutes in all. Because I think that's like a very good sweet spot in general. Uh -huh. Right, right. Then again, this is, like you said, heavily story based. So mm. we can't really cut out too much. Maybe put in some more timestamps when something boring happens. Yeah, because like. The, the first cutscene is good, it introduces what you're doing is long but it does its job well in my opinion and really showcases it gets you hyped i guess but if you already watched it a few times it's kind of boring time you know consuming. time consuming it's kind of like if you were to watch it and try to try to show all, all over again but you have to you didn't have to watch through all the fillers or all the episodes that didn't matter at all there it is it's the next one big boy Boy. Oh, turn off that music. That music is so good. Because there's the thing. Something I really like about Shadow Colossus is how every boss or every Colossus is its own little. is its own little puzzle. It's a cat. Because here, like here, you can see under the tubes, but even if you didn't pay attention, you can still, like, pull out your sword and find it. And then you have to find the right moment. And later in the game, it changes a lot. Because now you just have to find a weak spot on the body, but later on, you're gonna have to use the environment. And that's something I was really cool, in my opinion, to see actually using it. Come on! Let me now! Oh no, now we need oh. high. Look at that! The boy, high now. We, he may. <laughs> I mean, he, they get a toothpick right under his skin. I don't can't really blame him. He's shaking. But aren't those hooves really hard? Even yeah, underneath, the they're actually like normal. And like, they're I haven't really played with a horse before. If you can say that. Uh, you could, I'm pretty happy you had played with a horse. Cause that sounds just sounds weird. Listen to the music. The music is the best part, I think. What? Epic jump. Why did he jump? I, I jumped. I. Why did he jump over there? Okay, wait. Um, hit it. Yeah, fuck you. That's the first time we hit. You have hit the back way. <laughs> the arrow is just stuck on the side. Like it's not even impaled. It. It just like the wood is just leaning onto the hoop. It's actually better to hit the back hoof, it seems, because then you can just skip that part. But yeah. the music while you're playing this is so good in my opinion. Then again, the back hoof, obviously it's harder to hit because it doesn't lift that like miles so, up in the air. Yeah, it's pro it probably is meant for four speeders in my opinion. Oh my god, Wanderer. You have such a steel grip, it's ridiculous. Come on, the max charge! What is that blue shiny thing on his face? <laughs> it's a weak spot. 
a weak spot. It's probably... Is that, Do I have any blue marks on me <laughs> marking my weak spot? Well, is my cock blue? <laughs> <laughs> even my bro... Even him was laughing. Oh, it's, it's gone. Yeah. He did. He leaking all the things out of his head. I mean, it's probably because, like... It was somehow we needed to kill him one day, probably, so... To kill them with people who were like, oh, let's just mark their weak spot with blue ink, blue glowing ink. But let let's just make it a very hard thing where we don't want anyone to fight fighting. Wonder you, you clumsy bastard! Come on. Oh. Like this is what I mean. How are you, are you supposed to hand like have your grip? Like how are you able to hand, hold on to that? This dude is absolutely insane. Does this dude have nose rings? Oh, you're boring. He only has the cat rings. And for all those who don't know, you see the yellow circle? That's essentially my stamina. And when I stab, sorry I said it earlier, but when I stab, you see how I get ready to stab and you see how like a thing comes out from it. The longer it, the wider it gets, the more damage I do. But then the longer I have to wait. So if it begins shaking while I'm charging, I will lose that hit and waste stamina. And that's, that's kind of that's gonna be pretty important later in the game when you're gonna have to like manage the stamina while you're fighting someone. Because these bosses are easy. These two ones are easy. You can see that I would just one shot them. Ooh shit. Then again, we did them on hard mode and normal mode already. I mean, yeah. Yes. Why is, is why is it, I understand the black from his mouth, but why is it coming black from his stomach? That's kind of maybe he got the weak spots. <laughs> he just goes out from his what do you call it? Wee wee. No, <laughs> the thing on your stomach, the liver. No, 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 the thing on top. Belly button. Belly button. <laughs> my weak spot. My belly button, man. <laughs> Shit. It's now an Audi rather than an inner. It's a <laughs> double out. monkey. Short monkey. We, we, this video's gonna get flied for being racist. We are. <laughs> it's just. It's <laughs> they may be black, but they're not monkeys, nothing. Well, I'm not calling them monkey because they're black. I'm calling them monkey because they look like monkeys when they climb out of them. How do you look like monkeys, really? I, just, I don't get it. When they climb out of the ground at the very start, they kind of look like monkeys in the animation. I guess, maybe. A giant canopy soars in the heavens. The anger of the sleeping giant shatters the earth. This is essentially a game. You just go back, you kill him, and you come back. He did. Because now I see my stamina's increased. He's got a little ball of wee wee now. <laughs> anyway, this is gonna be the first episode. I think I'm gonna end it over here. It's been about 30 minutes, so we hit the goal, I guess. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you want to see more content like this, hit that subscribe button down below. Then you can follow up on the series and see me and definitely just fuck around and kill all these giant badass dudes. Because this game is absolutely astounding, quite honestly. And we're just, <laughs> quite honestly, this first part, we're just playing because, like, we are, we're joking because we already did this, like, two times. But the next episode, we will take some more, more seriously, huh? A little bit more. It's a little bit. A little bit. Maybe not call them monkeys. <laughs> probably. It's probably good not to call the black guys monkeys. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. As always, stay awesome. Bye-bye.